Hey, it's Dave Altavilla for Hot Hardware, and I'm here with Lyle from Intel, who is going to show us some pretty interesting stuff, Thunderbolt 5 technology and a creator video application. Lyle, take it away, buddy. Hey, thanks, Dave. Hey, super excited. We're here at Intel Innovation, and we're highlighting the amazing things that you can do with the modern studios. In this case, we're showcasing for the very first time a, a, a laptop enabled with Thunderbolt 5. This happens to be a Raptor Raptor Lake HX refresh system prototype with Thunderbolt 5. So not only do we have a Thunderbolt 5 prototype laptop, but we also have a Thunderbolt 5 prototype dock. In this case, not only is this a dock, but it has two terabytes of PCIe Gen 4 storage. Now, what can we do with that? We can create an amazing workspace for creators. Okay. I've got 11 different devices all connected behind this cable right here. What I have is, up here I've got two, um, my 6K monitor, okay. and I've got a 4K monitor, right? So I've got all this visual real estate. Plus, nice. of course... You're driving Thunder, uh, driving a 6K and a 4K monitor over Thunderbolt 5. Over Thunderbolt 5. And you got Thunderbolt 5 extor uh, external storage. External storage inside my dock. Got it. Right? I've got, got of course, my mouse, my keyboard, headset, speakers, 4K webcam. All these peripherals that are you know generating and utilizing data, yep, and of course our, our display. Now, what we're doing here from a creator standpoint is let's say we're actually going to do some streaming out of a tutorial that we're going to do. So, I've got Premiere Pro over here, I'm editing 8K video, this is 8K video content that's stored on my external Thunderbolt dock in this case, right? So okay. all my content is actually stored here. Okay. Now not only am I doing that, I'm using OBS to stream out what we're doing out to YouTube live. So we're using the power of the of the processor and streaming out there. Now that's not enough. What I also want to do is I'm gonna go ahead and start recording. So not only am I editing AK video, I'm gonna not only am I streaming out to YouTube, I'm gonna record back to the same drive I've got AK. So let's look at my 8K content over here in Adobe Premiere Pro. Yeah. So I've got my 8K, I've shot at the beach, I've got my dog over out on the beach running around, and now it's all decode using the integrated graphics on Raptor Lake HX, super smooth. Next what I can do is I've also used AI to create a 9x6 with auto reframe. So I've reframed that sequence now keeping the dog always in frame, still utilizing 8K content. This is Adobe Premiere running? Adobe Premiere. Yeah. So I can stop my recording, and we can go down here, and we'll see the video pop up. And this is the local recording that we just made. With my phone in it. Nice. With your phone in it, with your picture, <laughs> everything like that, right? Yeah. But you can see the quality, right? We have smooth. So now we can go back and edit it, post it on other social sites, do whatever I want backup, that kind of stuff. So, great story about all the bandwidth that creators and gamers are looking for today. So, streaming simultaneously, uh, and and then AI manipulation of 8K video source to, you know, different formats for things like TikTok and what have you, and then being able to stream it simultaneously and record your local environment while you're doing it. Exactly. Creating your local copy, your local backup, all that over your... Thunderbolt 5 link. Nice. That is a uh, content creation gauntlet. That's yes. what we call that. There you go. <laughs> Good stuff from yeah. Intel Innovation 2023. Thanks very much, Lyle. I Thanks, appreciate Dave. it. Appreciate it.